Hello everyone, this is uh, Sian Huang from University of Haifa. Our topic today is uh, reconstructing an S-box from its uh, difference distribution table. This is a joint work with Professor or Dunkelman. First of all, let me introduce the background and the motivation of our research. A difference distribution table of an S-box is an essential component in uh, differential cryptanalysis. We show the definition of difference distribution table of an S-box in the following way. Um, for here, the S-box is from uh, uh, n-bit input to n-bit uh, output. It can be seen from the definition that uh, deriving DDT from S-box uh, is uh, uh, very easy, uh, but the opposite way is, uh, very, is a very difficult uh, problem. Uh, but the problem is interesting and important because uh, the ability to recover the S-box from the DDT of a secret S-box can be used in a lot of attacks. Bora et al. proposed a straightforward guess and determine problem to solve, algorithm to solve this problem. Uh, in our talk today, we will show a new approach by applying the well-established relation between the DDT and the LAT. Similar, similarly, the LAT of an S-box is uh, an essential component in linear attacks, and uh, uh, the LAT of an S-box is defined uh, in the following way. wash hadmat transform is used a lot in our, in our research, so we, we show the definition uh, here. We can build uh, the links between an S-box, its DDT, and uh, LAT with the help of uh, uh, wash hadmat uh, transform. Uh, in lemma 1, you can see that when we apply uh, wash hadmat transform to, uh, to the LAT, we can obtain the character, characteristic function of uh, S. It means we recover the S-box. And from theorem 2, we apply the wash hadmat transform to the DDT and we get the squared uh, L LAT here. Uh, to summarize, to summarize the, the properties, we can go from the given DDT to the squared LAT with uh, theorem 2 and we can go from uh, the real LAT to the S-box uh, with uh, lemma 1. Uh, the problem is uh, how can we go from the squared LAT to the real LAT? If we solve this part, if we solve this part, we can go from the given DDT to the uh, real, to the, to the S-box. It means that we uh, we recover the 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 secret S box. In our uh, approach, we firstly define the sign determination problem uh, to recover the, the some columns in the squared LAT. If we can recover M columns. The, uh, M columns in the LAT, we can recover the the real LAT, and we can derive the the S box. If we don't have M columns recovered, we can still apply our improved GD algorithm to reconstruct the S box. And usually for this routine, it's uh, it's uh, quite trivial and less efficient. Uh, 
So we will stay on this uh, uh, research line and focus uh, on improve the GD algorithm. We define the sign uh, determination problem in the following. And before we define the problem, we, we need to show the cross uh, notation as the following. Uh, v cross here is a vector of uh, absolute values of the entry in the entries in the original vector. Um, and the sign determination problem of uh, B, the B uh, column in an LAT is a problem of uh, recovering lambda B from lambda cross. It is uh, uh, to determine the signs of uh, of of a column in L, in the LAT. So next uh, we will uh, we will propose a, a new algorithm to solve the sign determination problem. Uh, we firstly uh, introduce the linear relation between lambda b and s b. For any b column of the linear approximation, the following formula always holds. For the formula here, h uh, hn refers to the Hadmard matrix, uh, and it the Hadmard matrix can be represented as the following way. Because of the special form of the Hadmard matrix, we could solve the system of uh, linear e e equations uh, uh, interactively. And uh, we apply, we just uh, apply the elementary transformation on, to the independent sub-problems by n times. And finally, we get uh, H0 as the diagonal of the matrix. So we uh, H0 is uh, as, as H0 is exactly one and we solve so we solve the, the problem. And then we introduce our basic algorithm. We apply the idea of solving the system to reduce the problems to the the problem into two independent problems. We com we firstly uh, guess all the possibilities and combine the possibilities uh, related uh, related values uh, and compute the 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 possible ice constraint of sub problems. We uh, recall the uh, as constraint uh, uh, as a as a vector, and all the possible constraints are contained in a foresight here. The problem of our basic uh, algorithm is that the size of the uh, uh, foresight uh, grows so fast. And we we try to solve this problem by proposing an improved algorithm. In the new algorithm, we observed the, the a symmetric uh, structure in the foresight. It means that uh, um, other vectors in an equivalence class can be obtained by simply operating uh, transforms and uh, uh, permutations on the representative uh, vector. So we don't need to record all the vectors. We just uh, record the representatives of the equivalence classes in the compact set. Um, the, com the compact representat representation reduces uh, both time and uh, memory complexity. Uh, every time we derive the component site in the next layer, we construct a, a middle site uh, 
to to guarantee that the the derived set of uh, derived set is indeed the compact set. Here is our improved algorithm. We compute uh, the the middle set, and uh, we 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 compute the new vector and check the uh, consistency of the of the vector. If uh, if it is it is satisfied the the consistency, we can we include the new vector in the in 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 the in the new compact set. Still, um, the we uh, the for some cases the size of a compact set grows very fast. To solve this, we 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 set a, a heuristic threshold uh, according to the accessible memory of the attacker. And we define we define good columns and bad columns according to the threshold. We call a column in the uh, uh, absolute uh, LAT good if it can be recovered under the threshold uh, applying algorithm two. Otherwise, we call the column bad column. According to our experiments, uh, the solutions uh, for the good columns usually contain at most uh, two equivalence classes. We analyze uh, the complexity of algorithm to here, and uh, give and we give the upper bound of memory complexity and time complexity. Before we introduce the improved GD algorithm, uh, we we need to describe the matching phase for k independent good columns. Uh, suppose that we have solved the sign determination problem for uh, k independent uh, 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 good columns. It means that we have already had some candidates for the k columns of uh, uh, of the LAT. So we need to find the right uh, combination which matches uh, the real LAT. Um, we define the independent uh, columns here uh, when we have k columns and uh, the binary representation, uh, representations uh, of uh, the indices are linear uh, independent over the field. We use this. Uh, uh, we use this uh, formula uh, to to find uh, the, the 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 matching uh, Boolean function, and we we try all the pos uh, possibilities and uh, uh, compute the new the, the the vector and check the consistency. Next, uh, we will show the improved GD algorithm. Um, for here, we have already known the, 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 some components of S-box. For example, C0 SX to CK minus 1 SX. Um, with this knowledge, we can check, uh, we, we check the, the consistency Every time we 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 guess uh, the new assignments, we analyze uh, the GD or uh, GD the complexity of GD phase here, and uh, the the com time complexity is uh, is shown as following. Uh, we we show the complexity. Uh, curve for 8-bit input S box with different sizes of uh, outputs. It can be seen that when uh, the size of uh, output of S box uh, incre increases, uh, the the reconstruction precise uh, 
uh, becomes uh, much easier. It means that uh, uh, to to keep uh, to keep uh, a large output uh, uh, to uh, to it is insecure to keep such an S box as a secret S box. Uh, in this figure, we we show the complexity curve for random n bit S box with different key. The original uh, the the key here is for the number of good columns. The original GD algorithm when 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 k takes zero quickly becomes impractical with the size of uh, of uh, s box uh, of s box growing. To optimize the, the original uh, GD algorithm, the attacker have to find at least two independent good columns. When the number of uh, good columns grows, the effect of reducing the search space becomes less efficient. We uh, tested our results uh, with uh, experiments. We impl implemented our algorithms on th the following three types of uh, Boolean functions. And all of our experiments uh, are done on the on a single curve of uh, of this uh, Intel CPU. It is uh, amazing results because we can rec we could recover a uh, uh, a random fourteen bit fourteen bit S box in no more than one year. Well, for the uh, GD algorithm. The process uh, is very time consuming and takes uh, more than uh, 15,000 years. And from the standard derivation, we can, we can see that our approach is much more stable than the GD algorithm. From the arrow bar here, we can see that uh, the advantage of uh, our approach uh, over the uh, over the GD algorithm sharp, sharply increase with the size of uh, the S box growing. Uh, when the uh, input size of S box is uh, is larger than eleven, our approach is uh, better in all cases. We also tested uh, our algorithm on several. Uh, specific uh, S boxes, and our approach uh, out outperforms in several uh, several S boxes. Well, it is all uh, it it is difficult to find uh, good columns in the uh, uh, in the absolute LAT of uh, some S boxes. For example, the four differential uniformity S boxes and APN functions. Finally, we will uh, conclude our uh, talk and uh, uh, show some open problems. We presented uh, a new algorithm for reconstructing an S box from its DDT. The new algorithm is more efficient than the guess and determine algorithm uh, in many cases. Uh, for example, the the random S boxes uh, starting at the size of uh, ten ten bits, it pro outperforms uh, the previous uh, GD algorithm by several orders of magnitude. The new algorithm uh, should be very uh, be use very useful to explore uh, problems related to the DDTs. Uh, some other related open problems are the problems of uh, reconstructing an S box from its BCT and its uh, DLCT. Uh, this is uh, our report, and thank you very much for your attention.